I have just spent the whole day editing my blog for today. Basically, my blog from yesterday when I was in the city center that I uploaded and published it today. <laughs> Other than that, I've been watching YouTube because I was having like YouTube in the background as I edited and just saving up energy for human interaction later today. So yesterday I was in couch surfing, which is an app not sponsored. It's an app that helps you connect with people around you, whether those are travelers or local people. Sometimes they can offer you literally a couch so you can stay in there for like accommodation. And other times they just meet for events. So I am going to attend an event today. This is one that is a classic. People have it all over the world. It's usually at Irish pubs. If you know what I'm talking about, yes, it's a language exchange cafe, language exchange bar event, if you may. So after being all day in my pyjamas and recharging my social batteries, I think I'm gonna go. I am going. It's just, I'm lazy. I was on couch surfing yesterday and a girl called Sofia texted me and she was like, hi, I saw your profile. I have some Peruvian friends and I like them a lot. So are you here like just for a few days? So are you leaving here? Uh, would you like to meet up for something? And I was like, hi, yes, I'm only here for a few days. I leave on Monday. However, I saw this event on Couchsurf. Um, would you like to go together? And she was like, yeah, oh my God, I go there all the time. I checked out her profile. She looks like a social butterfly. Like she probably has a million friends. She has lived in Finland. She speaks multiple languages as well. So I'm gonna meet her today for drinks in this Irish pub and meet other people to practice languages with and meet other people with other cultures and stuff. I don't think I'm gonna drink that much only because it's out of my budget again, but I am excited to meet um, new people and try and make friends here. Uh, I think it just reminds me that because I have this stupid idea stuck in my head, which is just my anxiety telling me that once I get to Norway, I'm gonna be so alone and I'm not gonna have friends, blah, 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 blah. And it's like yesterday and today shows just how easy it is to make friends sometimes. Like if you really try, you can do it. And I sometimes feel like, oh, I'm such an introvert. It's hard for me to meet people, but I can do it. If I put myself out there, if I use all the resources I have, like these apps, like meeting people on the street, like meeting people through YouTube and social media, then it's easier to connect. I can do it. I can totally do it. And I have to start believing in myself a bit more and being more confident. Today is gonna be easier though, because there's gonna be liquid confidence, which is beer, alcohol, yay. I'm not gonna stay up late though, because tomorrow I have to go to the embassy at 9 a.m. That is a whole other topic, and I'm gonna explain it tomorrow, because I don't have the energy to do it today, and I am still mad. But just know things are okay, I just have to be up early tomorrow, so I won't stay up till too late today in the Irish pub thing. I plan to be back here at midnight, at around midnight, because this is not my house and I don't want to disturb anyone by arriving late. My cousin has school tomorrow. Anyways, I'm gonna go get ready now to leave in a bit. You know, it's not like I have many outfit choices anyways. I travel with one backpack, so this is what we're working with and honestly, it's all about the attitude. So I'm just gonna walk in like I own the place and people better believe it. Also, I'm Peruvian, so that makes me interesting, even in Chile. not what I was expecting out of this night. Thank you. Lighting, camera, actions. I only had two beers. I'm fine. 